This is the Evening Buzz, presented by Mikhail Atia. Now with the fourth season of Demon Slayer coming to a close, there's so much discussion and buzz about what is going to come next for this anime series. Now, Demon Slayer, I think already when I say that name, a lot of anime fans know what I'm talking about. It is one of the most viewed, most popular anime in recent years. Um, this is a, a franchise that has broken records in sales and comic and manga sales in Japan and worldwide. Like it, the re the sales record for Demon Slayers, uh, Demon Slayer has reached like levels of One Piece. That's how big of a show, a big of a series this is. But it is coming to a close in a sense. Now, the manga has finalized the story a few years back, and the anime is slowly catching up to the finale, the final arc of Demon Slayer, which is uh, titled as the Infinity Castle arc. And um, that last episode of season four, episode eight, which was literally at the length of 40 minutes, I'm telling you, high octane, one of the best animation quality production to and, and just recent in recent history i mean i i wouldn't say i'm the biggest fan of demon slayer but i do watch the i do watch the show I, the season when they come out i really do enjoy them it's phenomenal it's really great actually and so it gets me kind of hyped because the end of season four kind of teases the final arc and it's already gonna be you can already if those who have read the manga are aware of the ending of this of the show it's gonna be absolutely climactic it's gonna be epic and so the question is when are we gonna get the final arc well apparently it was announced that we are gonna be getting a movie trilogy so the final arc is gonna be uh, depicted into a three-part movie and uh, this already gets me really really stoked because especially when anime is in movie form it means that the quality the production the animation is a top priority and it's you can already tell you're gonna be watching you're gonna be watching this these three-part movies back to back and they're just gonna be absolutely astonishing I think it's a uh, it's a cho it's the right choice for a series like this that has always been praised for its production value. So, especially because this is a very lengthy final arc, uh, doing it into episodics, you know, like an episodic uh, series, is just not enough. Uh, there's a lot to cover, and I think they really want to give every uh, battle, uh, every confrontation, every moment um, its rightful due, and. The production quality is seems to be at top priority here. So to have a three-part movie is great, but it means we have to wait just a bit longer. Now, there hasn't been a confirmed release date for each of those movies, um, but I could expect maybe by next year, the first part of that, that movie trilogy will come out. And what's really great is that movies like this, movie releases like this, do find them way do find their way into theaters so i know it's going to be coming out here in, in the in the theaters here in sharjah in the uae and i'm going to be very stoked i love when we get something like this because it feels like a cultural event you, you get to be part of something that is uh, really uh, just uh, well beloved well shared by the anime community uh <laughs> And I can't really say too much about Demon Slayer, only that it is a very popular show. And uh, um, I know I'll be rewatching some moments from the previous seasons just to kind of get myself ready for when those movies come out. And hopefully when they do, I'll be sure to review them here on the Evening Buzz. But for anime fans out there, what is your prediction? When do you think the first movie of the trilogy is gonna be coming out? Is it gonna be next year from now, maybe two years? Who knows? Anime production is very unpredictable. Things can sit into development hell for quite some time. But I trust that Demon Slayer is a franchise that takes a tremendous amount of priority by the studios involved. And they want to they want to release it as soon as possible. But I always can respect when 
a creative team, a creative production team can be very honest and transparent about, hey, we want to make the best adaptation of your favorite of your favorite show. And it, what that means is that it requires time. I think when production teams and the people, you know, the executives, the producers involved understand that something for something to be great, it requires time and patience. I think that's always the right approach. And I think we're all willing to wait for those movies to come out and they're going to come out banging. So I'm excited. Demon Slayer movie, final final arc movie trilogy. Hopefully by next year, if anything, I'll be sure to keep you guys updated on any new details, but you can check out a teaser trailer for the movie trilogy on YouTube by Crunchyroll. And you can, uh, yeah, you, you can see it for yourself. Get hyped. But uh, it's going to be a while. Don't worry about it. And with that, guys, it's time to wrap it up here on the Evening Buzz. Thank you so much for tuning in. And I'll see you guys tomorrow from 8 till 9 p.m. Keeping you guys busy and entertained all throughout the weekend shift right here on Pulse 95. This is Mikhail Atia signing out. Have a good one. If you liked this episode of The Evening Buzz, drop a like and subscribe. Be sure to follow us on Instagram for all our daily updates and top stories.